Hello, the international freshman. My name is Nadim, and this video will inform you about all methods that are relevant for a successful start in the Frankfurt University of Light Sciences. Enjoy the video. Normally, we would greet you personally on our campus. You would meet your fellow students and learn about all the important things that are important for you to know right now. Unfortunately, as you may know, due to the corona situation, it is not possible to do so. But then I'll let you down and all by yourself. We, the General Students Committee, short ASTA, in cooperation with the university, have established an online freshman entering guide, which consists of a collection of videos. But there are three for you most important videos that you need to watch. The one with general information, the other that contains all online sessions in English, and the last, which is a virtual guided tour of our campus. The university is managed by our presidium, consisting of the president, two vice presidents, and the chancellor. One very significant advantage of our university is a central campus for all departments, which means that normally all activities regarding your studies will take place on this very campus. That also includes the blue building on the other side of the street, on the other side of the street, which is called BCN or CityGate. This year we have a quite serious situation. As you may have read, on the 25th of March, Building 9 was on fire. At this point of time, we cannot judge to what extent it will affect us. Nevertheless, rest assured, the university is attending the problem and they will find solutions for the short term. Any of you who are directly affected by those circumstances will be informed and there might be slight adjustments regarding relocation um, of the lecture rooms and study activities. In uni, it is all about participation and self-engagement. Hence, you have the chance to contribute to your fellow students by working with the student parliament, senate and women's commission. For further information about the structure of both university and ASTA, please check the website of the ASTA or of the university. Most of your studies you will spend in your own department. In total, there are four departments. Now the question appears, to what department do you belong? For that matter, let's have a look at all faculties. Faculty 1, Architecture, Civil Engineering, Ge Geomatics. Faculty 2, Computer Science and Engineering. Faculty 3, Business and Law. Faculty 4, Health and Social Work. Now some information regarding the structure of the departments. Each department has its own administration, which is the deanery, that consists of the dean, the vice dean, and the student's dean. Further, on each department, it has its own examination office and department-specified committees, which are as following. The department council. They form the audit board and additionally deal with early attained achievements, achievements or, for instance, other courses of study, which you have may attend, attained earlier on in your life. The student council. The student council. All your fellow students embody the student council. Usually when someone is speaking of the student council, they attend to address the most active members of the student council among you. Those active members are working honorary in the interest of you fellow students. Each department council has its own chamber. That is a place where you can ask questions, find suitable solutions and advice. Additionally, there are information videos of each student council which are only available in the German language. However, in the video description you may find all important links for making contact. The acronym ASTA stands for Allgemeiner Studienausschuss, that is equivalent to the General Students Committee, which is a university-wide student representative body. The committee represents the students' interests before university, society and politics. Its members are annually elected by the student parliament. The ASTA is also a member of many institutions and organizations. In addition, the ASTA is working with student experts in order to helping them and supporting their projects, which are all in the interest of the students. Furthermore, there are several counseling and service-related offers maintained by the ASTA, such as the ASTA shop in social coaching, the counseling office for international students, the next bike rental service. The bikes are free of charge within a time of 60 minutes. After that, the user will be charged one euro for every started half hour. In addition, one user can rent up to three bikes at a time. Finally, legal cost insurance, which entails tenancy law, traffic law, and labor law. The ASTA is located in the center of the campus in the so-called, and even painted, Red House. More information about all of us may be found on the ASTA website. The corresponding link is in the video description below. Networking is fairly important, especially when it comes to not missing guidelines, deadlines, comparing learning material, establishing study groups, and overall helping each other out. There are plenty of possibilities to cross-link with your fellow students. For instance, every year there are WhatsApp and Telegram groups prepared for specific courses of study, which can be joined after instructions which are given in the video of the departments. 
For that, please check the video description. Another social media platform you can use is Facebook. There you can find general freshman groups generated by the ASTEM. In some cases, you might find course of study related freshman groups in Facebook as well. Again, for further information, please check the video description. The study chip is a student ID. It gives you significant advantages in many matters. For instance, you receive sales for theater, museum, cinema, and swim world. If your study chip is on hand, never hesitate to ask for available sales on leisure activities. Beyond, your study chip is also your public transport ticket. By paying the annual study fee, you gain access to the local buses, trams, undergrounds, and regional trains. Here you may find the scope of application for your public transport ticket dash study chip. Down the line stations are border stations. From that point on, your study chip will be invalid, thus additional fees will apply. Please be aware that you need to renew your study chip after every term. The former you may do in the building one, using the imprinting machines next to the study bureaus. Please consider that a renewal is only possible once paid the annual study fee. Another function of your study chip is using it as a payment method. You can charge your study chip with your debit card at the point of intersection between building four and the canteen. Once charged with money, you can pay for meals in the canteen or pay for printing orders in the computer facilities or in a follow me, follow me print offer by provided by the ESTA. For further information respectively, please check ASTA's website. Finally, with a study chip, you may borrow books from the library of the university, obtain access to learning rooms of the CityGate or BCN. In special severe cases, you can refund your study chip. For respect information in that sense, please visit the ASTA website. For fellow internationals, the international office is the most suitable place for questions about a foreigner's office, foreigner's registration office, healthcare, banking, and housing. For undergraduate students, Mr. Schwan and Mrs. Kabut are the right reference person, whereas for exchange students, Mrs. Langer should be addressed. All the relevant contact data may be found in the video description. Bodies are students who can help you into Alia with following things. Picking you up from the airport, helping you out in mission procedures, finding accommodation, helping you in insurance and bank account opening procedures, advising you about city and daily life, informing you about university, study and exam related issues, practicing the German language with you, supporting you in cases of medical emergencies. If you need a body, please check the video description. Now I would like to dedicate the last part of the video for a bit of advice. Please read everything before signing it. If you're not sure, please seek assistance from a senior student or come to us to review it. For the sake of security, please do not share your Wi-Fi data. Please remain reasonable with downloading digital content. Do not download unauthorized software, music, movies, games, or other things in that sense for copyright reasons. Do not use torrent sites. If you are living with someone and already, have an, and already have given your data to authorities, please don't forget to leave your name tag on the post box in order to prevent any penalties and bills, for instance, of the insurance company. It is necessary to check your mailbox on a daily basis. If you do not receive any letters from your insurance company within one month, please contact us or the insurance company directly. For visa extension purposes, please make appointments with the Foreigners Registration Office in time for it may take a couple of months to get one. Please keep your bills and letters safely as they may be required even after a year. Always update your residence and contact information with the university. Once freshly arrived, please seek for a general practitioner. He or she may suggest necessary vaccinations depending on the region of origin. Please always have your ID on hand and in order to save time once needed. That must have been a lot of inputs. There's another clip about the online accessions regarding his portal, Moodle, student webmail, VPN and more with me. Please watch that one as well. I hope you found some helpful advice and information through the course of this video. Finally, there's only one thing to say. I know the times we are facing right now are quite tough, but rest assured it will be better soon. For that reason, make the best out of it. Please carefully follow the measures of the state in order to be safe and take care of our most vulnerable, our elderly. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to ask us or the respective places we mentioned earlier. We wish you health and very successful studies.